Hello everyone and welcome back to the quarry. In this video we are probably getting to an end of this series and it has been a blast. Um, so far we've accomplished it to only have one person killed. Poor Jacob boy. Hi Pink Jacob. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that man is gone though. And now we're gonna try to save everyone else. A bunch of people from the Hackett family died on the last episode too. I don't know if we could save them. I don't know if they were part of like trying to save or not. They started like being pretty cool in the beginning of the game. If you have watched it, the series, you know that they are trying to keep everyone alive and safe. But after Laura appeared again in the game, she killed Kaylee, one of the granddaughters. And then they decided to kill everyone, they didn't, like, they just went crazy. They were always crazy, <laughs> but they just came out of the closet as crazy. <laughs> <I guess>. <laughs> you <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> and now we're gonna uh -huh. continue. Let's see what's gonna happen. Oh, yes, we're gonna play Emma, because Emma is fine. She's alive and well. And the last time we saw Emma, we shot her three times with the shotgun. And she's fine. That's Honestly, oh. I can take three shots from the shotgun. Alright, and we think there's two things. werewolves around because not everyone probably was um, bit by, by Chris. Because there's also Caleb and yeah. Silas, the dog boy, around. So we Wait, don't know. Is <gasps> Max? The final girl? Oh my god! It's Max! Oh, oh man! Oh! oh. What, what the fuck? <laughs> Why am I on top of a fucking tree? Oh, come on, man. <laughs> What's going Laura? on? So they really have. They can't. See or remember anything from when they transform? Yeah. The so Nick is not gonna remember that. He can see. Oh, unless. Uh, has to dance. Unless he turned back into human while he was eating Jacob. Yeah. That would be really bad. Where the hell am I? Yeah, so now, like, we don't know if Nick is still a werewolf. Because if he is, Caleb is still a werewolf. So we don't know if we're gonna kill Caleb or Nick. If we, like, have to kill a werewolf, we don't know which one is who. Right. We need to remember something. Is there something that Nick had, like, a tattoo or something? Is the game gonna give us a clue if that comes to happen? That would be really nice, right? I hope so. I don't want him to die. You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> What's going on? What is it? I don't know, I found some clothes. What is oh, I think it's girl clothes. <laughs> okay. Oh. oh gotta find God. Laura. Or Max. Nice. <laughs> Looking good. <laughs> That's very Max-like. <laughs> oh wow, okay. There's something over here. There are fire. I'm gonna look like it he's wearing like Evan's clothes or something. Yeah, he might be. Remote Harbinger Motel. Don't, we should have just gone to the Harbinger Motel. Yeah, dude. Yeah. Oh my god. Is there anything you can read? You will wish you stopped by. Oh my god. <laughs> That's messed up. <laughs> okay, we can probably go over there or over here, and we don't know exactly what's going to progress the game, so I'm very scared to pro progress. You think going to the pier is going to progress? I don't know, you'll just have to find out. I think he was looking over there, right? So, here might be fine. Yeah, it's in the card. Because technically there's, there's one more card, but... It doesn't make any sense to find a card on this episode. Because you have no time to 
to have the girl tell us about the car. I mean, not a girl, the old lady. Did they ever give her her name? Uh. I think so. Because so. Constance is the name of the grandmother who we shot. The shot. And we don't know her name. Hiking simulator. I love this game. There's nothing really to look for right here, I assume. So we just keep going. <gasps> Is this Emma's? That's yeah. Laura's, I think. That's oh, it's Laura's? Oh. Uh, oh, right, she's this Laura's. <laughs> he took it too. <laughs> Full pink vibe. Interesting, because this place here. Is where we would go with Emma if we had gone through the bottom. So you can't even find the car if you go there later. Unless. Unless. The camera has to be on an angle. I'm not gonna go too far. I just wanna make sure. Imagine if we could find the car. I mean, maybe, but definitely there's no card here right now. The thing is that some cards, they're not like right for the next episode. Some of them are like two episodes later or something. Yeah, you just have to remember. Is he safe on this island? I feel like he's super safe there. I feel I like he's the he's only close. werewolf that was on this island. Right? Because Silas is at the road. So he's not on the island. Ah, oh, we should stay. What do you think? Oh, I don't like this. I think... I think you're right. He's safe. You think? Because Nick is not there, right? Nick is at the house, the house is out of the island, the road is out of the island, so he's the only one there. Let's just keep him there. Oh my god, I did that to Jacob and that was a mistake! <laughs> <laughs> oh no, you have to just make a decision and hope it's the right one. Yeah. I think he's going to be fine. Also, Swim is not, not a good one. Ten people on the goddamn podium. Ciao. Oh, Katie is alone. Okay, nice. Hopefully they realize the campus glows and try them out to up the road. Oh my god, that's scary. Okay. Okay, <laughs> okay Caitlin. The rain's been off and on all night. These fuckers know you're in here. They're coming back for a chance to get. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Is she loaded with... Okay, I need to I get mean, to I'm just gonna shoot whatever comes, because I can't take any chances. If you don't shoot them, they kill you. I can't really take chances. Where do you want to go? go? Upstairs? Like, right away? Oh. Should we explore a little bit? Sure. One thing we can't do is go to the basement. Wait, is Abby here? Abby oh. is here. She's at the office. She's at Chris' office. Right? What are we doing with this girl? She's a very short. She looks like older. Then she's shorter. Doesn't she? Maybe it's just like the clothing. 
You're saying that she looks short for her age? Yeah, for the way she looks. She looks like she's another person, but just like very short. I mean, anyone can be short. Yeah. I'm mean, just commenting. Just making a comment about the boy while I'm scared. Look at this window. It's covered in something. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what the heck? Oh, there's something over here. There's light. <gasps> oh, do you remember when we went around here with Jacob? He said it would suck to be stuck inside of this place. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm scared to go into the kitchen now. Because I'm sure it is there. It's the fridge. Alright, let's go upstairs and hope for... That was like on second, or yeah, second episode, I think. God damn, it's been a long time. I think Abby's here at the Chris Hackett's place. Why are those papers so outstanding? Nice to put a name to a big name face. So what, you're like Mr. H's brother, I guess? Oh no. Oh it's Caleb's. Does it say Caleb on it? I think it was Bobby. Bobby. Oh hack it. Bobby M. Okay. Oh it says AP so shoot. <laughs> what the heck? Oh, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I don't know what it, that means. Oh, we can go up over. Oh, that's the dorm. Poor Bobby. Oh, we're gonna find people. Is it a ladder? Jeez, I'm see really struggling if they're begging for a dollar. Chris Hackett is asking campers' parents for additional donations to help with lodge renovation costs. Isn't that what camp fees are for? Where else would that money be going? Yeah. Where else? In defeating werewolves? True. Up more. Last time we went up on a, in an attic, there was a werewolf tied to a goddamn pillar. It'll be fine. Is that where you want to go? Don't be scared. You don't want to check the hack it. Oh my god, is that <laughs> That's creepy as hell. You don't want to go check over there for Abby? Sure. Let's go here. Face the fear. Face. Hello? This looks like Pathophobia Attic. What is. Oh, it's a mirror. <gasps> oh! Oh! The high priestess. Oh, that's the, that's the old lady. Oh, Eliza. Eliza was killed in the fire that broke out at her traveling show six years ago. <laughs> her ghost roams the woods of Hackett's quarry ever since, and she's been determined to get revenge on the Hackett family for what they did to her. Her tarot cards, once lost in the blaze, have allowed her to guide you through the night, though her motives may not have been as transparent as first thought. The last two cards are literally just like, they're not warnings. Yeah, it's just lore. Yeah, interesting. Wow, we got 17 out of 22 cards. That's pretty good. Yeah, that's pretty good. Interesting. 
Nice. I was not expecting to find a card here or on this episode after all, but since those cards are not like something that really, really has a real message to it. I mean, it's kind of a warning in the sense that like, we shouldn't trust her, but we already don't. Yeah. <laughs> we never <laughs> did. You don't usually trust someone who has a bunch of skulls around them. I do. And laugh at saying death is just death for you? Yeah. Oh wow. I guess we're not on the same page on that trusting thing. <laughs> <laughs> um How long has this guy been here? Who's that guy? I never seen that guy there either. Large and overbearing in this regal oil painting of Septimus Hackett. Is Septimus the old man? Or is he like an older, older oh. family member? I don't know. What's his name? No, it's his ancestral portrait, so it must be older. Yeah, that's true. You're right. You should be detected. On the log chimney column. <laughs> Prepare for what? Oh. I'll keep looking. Maybe I should keep looking. Oh, maybe preparing. Oh. Uh oh. Maybe we should prepare. We're it's not gonna thing. be prepared. Where is the office? Like, I thought it was on the other side of the on the second floor. Whatever first floor? I don't know American floors. Is, is this the second floor? After you go one stair up? Yeah. Oh. Uh, oh. What is that? Ian. Uh, Ian was a lamb. Was like. <laughs> oh. Poor Ian. Wasn't a person. Some camp mascot to kick it before camp starts. Ian was fed to the werewolf. To the disease and camp mascot Ian. From the looks of the drawing, Ian was a sheep. Though nobody got to meet him this year. Ian was fat to oh, Chris. Hindsight. Sounds about right. Oh, for Ian. <laughs> That's why we found like Ian Collar. Yeah, Ian I remember. Yeah. I thought it was like a dog. Uh huh. And after that, like, we thought it was, like, some family member who was a werewolf, and then now, like, we absolutely know, like, what Ian was. And I'll <laughs> tell you that. Who are you? Sorry. Scared the hell out of me. <laughs> <laughs> Back to the phasmophobia attic. Are you gonna sit here and chillax? The rain. What's your pain? Where have I seen this emblem before? Emblem? Um, discarded jewelry thrown off in a scuffle. The description, the inscription reveals that it belongs to Bobby Hackett. Where have we seen that inscription before? I don't know. Do you know? I can even, I can barely see it. Uh, yep. Yeah. I don't remember that at all. Oh god damn. Oof, this is getting scary. Oh, there's a megaphone. I remember Mr. H's cheesy ass announcements. Oh shoot. Whoa. We should totally keep that. Busted. Okay. No. Like loud noises can can mess them up, right? Can yeah. We not fix this? Uh -oh. okay. so There's so much to explore. Imagine like preparing What's for this? the attack. We saw like storms. Trail cam footage. It's like they're looking for something. Oh, they have they have the cameras to look for silos. Oh. oh, full moon. They are full moon. They're looking for Silas. 
Archive trail cam footage from Hackett Woods, dating from back six years. Oh, wow. That's what, now everything is like coming together now. That's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> That's insane. Okay, we have one more place. I mean, I could investigate the kitchen, but I'm really scared of getting locked in. I was like, I don't understand why we couldn't find the office. Yeah, are we on the different launch? I, I swear the office like was like going up the stairs right there. I'm not sure anymore. There should be a place here to investigate or... Oh, never mind. They, they, yeah, that's right. They, they buried this for the Super or something. Well, I guess time to... Should we... We didn't find Abby. Like, the office is not here. Right? <laughs> like, I thought it was like right here. Yeah, it's not, but there's a dorm. It's not wrong. Kitchen. <laughs> yeah, let's you let's want to bake go? cookies. Oh my god, I'm scared. Imagine if she locks herself in there and die. Or save herself. She's just going to bake cookies. Oh, okay. That's a good time for that. Wait, yeah. today's not even cookies day. What today is? <laughs> Bugus. Hamburger. Hamburger. Okay, we cannot interact with this. Oh, we can find something though. Ooh. Oh, Abby's back. What the heck is this? Oh my god. Yeah. I'm a happy, happy bunny. <laughs> Wait, take that with you. Because you can throw it away somewhere and. and why do I feel it's gonna be used for something? Oh, her bag has like bad wings. Bad wings. That's cute. <laughs> yeah. Why do I think this this bunny was a mystery the entire time? We thought the bunny would attract the werewolves to Abby in the woods and they haven't. And now we see the bunny again. Oh, you know what? What if we can get the bunny, throw inside of the fridge? And the bunny attracts the thing to the fridge, and we lock it there. Ooh. That's awesome. I think that's what is gonna happen. Am I predicting it too hard? Am I a detective too? Not like me. Alright, let's prepare for the attack. I don't know what she's gonna prepare. I guess she's just gonna stand there. Oh, there's more than one. I'm scared! Oh, they're coming through the chimney. Chimney attack! Yep. Showtime, motherfuckers. Oh. Together, not long till morning. <gasps> what was that? Okay, now we're gonna know where this is. Oh, she was in the closet. Oh, she was like, yeah. What the? Oh. Uh, what the heck? Shoot the bastard. Wait to run. This I think. Run. Yeah. 
Yeah. Wait. We have one live. I mean, we have two lives, right? In the last we used it. We only have one, cause she already died once. <laughs> I'm sure we're going to save Nick if we do this. Because the bear has a meaning. The whole thing with the bear, that has to have a meaning. It can't be for nothing, right? Oh, maybe it's gonna be for nothing. Oh, oh boy. Oh boy. Don't worry, don't worry. Is this where Oski Park? Fired by Jurassic World. Maybe he's gonna die there. <laughs> <It's just laughs> freeze to death. We don't know. Whatever, but I really wanted to do that because when I saw the bear there, I was like, hmm, I'm freezing out of thing. <laughs> Perfect. Oh my god, now they're looking for Silas. Oh. 
inquisitive. So what exactly happened six years ago? There was a fire that wiped out dozens of people, and now there's werewolves and a ghost that roams the woods looking for her lost baby boy. Which I've just put together is Silas. Oh, shit. It's a long story. No, it's not. There was a fire. Silas, the wolf boy, escaped, bit a bunch of your family. You failed to stop him. We should saw the dog boy. Burn. What happened in the past doesn't matter right now. Uh, it kind of does, actually. We need to know what we're up against, at least. What we're up against is a feral boy turned werewolf for the last six years has avoided being found. No matter what we did. Every full moon we were out there looking. Every single one. Now the son of a bitch is finally here. So what we're up against is my only chance to end this thing for good. So how do you even know where he is? How the hell are we gonna find him just driving down the middle of the road? Oh! Uh... I don't think that's him, right? Oh, I'm just gonna mash your head. Oh, he's... He's chilling. Take the wheel, right? Yeah. We're gonna Travis. crash. Travis, get it together, come on! Where is Ryan? Did they both pass out? I'm so confused. Yeah. How did they pass out? I got it. I got it. Just get down. I don't know. It's a very bad coincidence. Oh, oh. 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 I got it. I got it wrong. Uh oh. Please, do something. Do something. <laughs> He's gotta be nearby. Was he white? Because they're looking for a white one, right? Let's look around. Are you crazy? I'm confused. I couldn't tell. It's kind of funny how she's been out there the entire like time looking for Are we there yet? A werewolf, and then when the guy You're wants okay. to go on, she's like, Are you crazy? Been better. <laughs> yeah. Wasn't what she was doing, like yeah. <laughs> the entire time. Over here. I think Travis is only like Got some die. blood. He just lost his entire family. Leads through there. Yeah, I kind of feel bad for him. What the hell happened back here? Yeah. Whoa. Oh, that's a nice scene. This God is damn. where we went off the road two months ago. You're trying to decide if you should shoot me in the head right now. Go ahead. If that's what you want, I won't stop you. What? No. Calm down. Normally, I'd have werewolf's blood cover our scent, but I'm all out, so we're high risk. We could be killed. Oh my god. You ready to end this? Yeah. Duh. This isn't the end. <laughs> no. <laughs> Let's fucking do this. She's right. Go team. All right. <laughs> <laughs> like going to you like a marshmallow right now. He's always a marshmallow. It all makes sense now. You've got wolf blood? Found it in the woods. Travis just reminded me. Um, you should take it. There's not enough for the both of us. 
No, I can't. I can't do that. It's yours. You've been through oh, a lot more than I have. Come on. Anyone deserves to get out of this. Our alive, favorite it's you. characters. We have to choose. Uh, Should we take it? Ryan. Are you gonna lose her? Yeah. Poor Laura. This is yours. Plus, I feel like she can defend sure. herself more than he can. Yeah, we'll be fine. I hope so. <laughs> I got this. <laughs> I like both of them. So this is the hard. That that was the hardest decision now. Because those Oof. are the best characters. Pungent. I Bro, feel like they could at dead. least like he could at least like put his hand on her. I mean, like, that, to give her a little sure, bit. I'm sure you'll be fine. You know? Yeah. I mean, his end is still like kind of like soaked from the blood there. Like, I get him. It's a little bit. Appreciate your sacrifice! Hello? <laughs> Spoil? Alert? Game? <laughs> it's not a sacrifice yet, man. Come on. Oh, I think she's wearing the old lady's clothes. Damn, this place has got some cool vibes. Podcasting. Well, not that she was wearing right now. Oh, she died, but this is like where a I dress. saw her. Kind of like her. Oh. I thought she was. I thought Max hit her, but then I was out here and she was something else. Who? The woman. The old woman. She was saying something over and over again. Oh my god, she was saying Silas. No, that's impossible. Who you're talking about? I saw her too. In the run tunnels. It's Eliza Voris. Silas's mother. I. Think. Who was she? she? Who was she? She ran a traveling sideshow called Harem Scarum. Came here six years back. She kept her son in a cage. Aww. Called him Silas the Wolf Boy. Died in a fire. Some say she never left. The hag of Hackett's quarry. We've been looking for Silas ever since. How did the fire start? Uh oh. Really? You're still hiding stuff now? You blew half the head off my niece, Kaylee Hackett. One of the kindest gentlest souls to ever walk this earth. I think she was shot in the chest. And all she wanted to do was help that little boy. Locked in a cage by that freak show witch. Oh. What did she do? She just wanted to help him. Oh, it was Travis. Kaylee's fault. She convinced Caleb to start a fire. It was just a distraction. It's May Bales. Give him enough time to get Silas out of his cage and give him his freedom. That's not what happened. No. Because within minutes, everybody was dead. You ever see Hayburn, Liza, whole crew? Kaylee managed to get Silas to freedom. But Caleb got bit in the process. <laughs> Meme. <laughs> I mean, that's, that's why you've that's been hunting not, him. That's not good. Silas, I mean. <laughs> Every full moon for six fucking years. That's, that's true, man. Some hunter you are. <laughs> She's <so funny. laughs> Oh, I really hope she doesn't die. This is all that's left. Jesus Christ. I mean, she has the gun. So Any sign? Probably needs the blood, Negative. right? That, make, that makes sense. Yeah. Damn, I never saw any of this. I didn't even know this was here. No, my God, he's going away. Okay, he needed the blood. He's crazy. It's going away. Got it! Ah! 
Oh, so the person who was like, close. We must that be was close. the woman. I like Did that. You see it too? I kind of wish I hadn't. Same. Wait, let me check out. Was there a card that talked about like giving things away? Likely. Sun, the vitality of a new day. There's still time to wake up the, to the warmth. I don't know when I survived. Your choice is your action. Your very life hangs in the balance. It's up to you to find your path in the darkness and see the sun rise once again. Was it the balance that we chose? Oh, this is totally Jacob. God damn. <laughs> That's his face, right? Yeah. <laughs> we did not that. I didn't pay attention to that card. Cow. Oh. This is totally, yeah. The, the bond. Like Laura. And yeah. Okay. I think we found the balance. I don't know. Did we find the balance? What is it? Silas the dog boy. I feel like that must be. Die. Careful. Unfortunately. Are you sure about this? A lot more people to die too. Yeah, and then no! Oh this sucks. No! Okay, he didn't die. Nobody died. God damn. That's an ugly little dude. Please, let's just, let's just go before we, we have to see him like that in human form. It's too late for that. Oh no. Are we not gonna see him? I guess not. See, I wanted to see who Silo was, god damn. The whole game is about him, the white wolf. Oh, she's gonna be mad. Uh -oh. I bet you think you have it all figured out. I bet you think you're fucking clever. I tried to help you. I tried to warn you. I even started to like you. Not now. Not after this. I will not forget what you made them do to my Silas. I've been with you all night. And I'm not about to stop now just because the night's come to an end. No. Uh -oh. Whenever you hear a noise in the dark, a whisper from the shadows, the breath on the back of your neck, that's gonna be me. I'll be there. Now I will never leave you. Sorry. I'll never leave you. God. <laughs> Good. <laughs> I like having a buddy. True. I always wanted to have a... What do you call him? Um, 
Meet up friend thing. I'm a matchmaking friend. Okay. Somebody go to the freezer and save the man at the freezer. Put it ring and I rise wipe the sleep out of my eyes my shaven razor's cold and it stings Cheer up sleepy Jean Oh Max survived the night Max was scared Bobby survived Oh my god Oh, I don't think you're gonna be saved, but he... Lara shot those face off in the I feel like... All of these people could be alive. I don't know. We could surely have left. After Ryan refused to help oh. these people. <laughs> God damn. Like, we can save Kaylee. That's true. It was a lie. Dylan's a lie. Oh, you know, Nika wasn't the one. Then it's Caleb. I thought he was too tall. Oh. Oh. When Sal was cute, Caleb lost his arm of humanity and froze. Oh my god! That's sad. <laughs> god damn it! At least it wasn't me. Yeah. That's so sad. Now I feel bad. But if he could have shot him, right? Yeah. Good job, boy. Oh, that silence. So the only camper, counselor person we killed was Jacob. Yep. The whole Hackett family besides Bobby and Travis died. Oh man. Bodies recovered in summer camp murder mystery. What do you make of that, Anton? Bad journalism? Murder mystery? Isn't that just an unsolved murder? <laughs> yes, I, I suppose that is what most journalists would say. But perhaps the journalists of North Kill share my supernatural suspicions. Hmm. Yeah, I guess there wouldn't be much competition in North Kill. Probably not getting the best writers there. Okay, can we at least start the podcast before you completely resign yourself to cynicism? I thought we'd done the whole Hackett's Quarry thing. Not this Hackett's Quarry thing. What was this, like three months ago? Old news, dude. Anton? Introductions first. We are Bizarre Yet Bonafide, the podcast of the paranormal. I'm Grace. And I'm Anton. And together we explore the possibility the of supernatural <laughs> involvement yeah. in real life <laughs> everyday Can we do that? And that's exactly no. what they are, real life everyday <laughs> occurrences. With a shadow of spiritual supernatural occurrences. No. What the heck? Okay, so... I hope you've got hat insurance, Anton, because I'm about to blow your mind. Did you just ask if I had hat insurance? Yes. <laughs> it's responsible to insure yeah. those things which mean he's, the most to you. He's a like hat. Nodding yes. to the, the, okay, I know where your priorities podcast, lie. Go on. Still go there anyway, every time. there actually is a real reason that we're coming back to Hackett's Quarry. There have been some developments, and I've sourced some information. <laughs> I remain skeptical, but I'm all ears. Under my hat. I was hoping you'd say that. Oh, God. Why? Why are you smiling? Stop it. I hate it. Why? I had braces. I have to make use of them sometimes. You do have very pretty teeth. Thank you. That's something that a lot of podcast listeners might not know about me. <clears throat> well, so, hell. it just so happens <laughs> I've got someone on the inside. So, today's episode is going to have a bit of a show-and-tell vibe to it. 
who do you know on the inside? The inside of where? Brian. What? You know someone on the inside? Don't we all have someone on the inside? You know, an inner critic that mm. says, stop doing a podcast. No one's listening. You should listen to that voice, Grace. Okay, well, what I really meant is, let's <laughs> call it an <laughs> anonymous <laughs> donation. You know, we're not the only ones who oh, flagged because. this as a bizarre situation. Someone actually reached out to us. They sent us a package. Did you? You didn't open it. Anyone who, I don't trust anyone who listens to this show. Oh, I couldn't wait to open it. Surprise! Anonymous donation. Okay, you've always promised me since day one of this podcast that if you could see true evidence, you will consider all options, right? Did you not say that? I did say that, yes. I mean, I know Knowing for a fact that we would never see any evidence, I did say that. Okay, well, we've been sent information and we need to decide whether it's bizarre or bona fide. <sighs> okay, fine. Let's do this. For anyone listening at home, we are about to open a package from a mysterious person who listens to this show. If you are the one who sent us whatever it is, congrats, you got us. God, sorry, the tape is just really... Really? There's just so much tape on the Oh my god, what is in the box? Sorry, can you help me with this? Do you have like a key I could a like baby slice werewolf? at it with? No, I don't want you to dull my key. Just use your fingers. But just give me your fucking key, Anton. No. Give me your fucking key. No. Get your own key. It's not like you lock your door. Of course I lock my door. What are you what are you hiding? What am I hiding? Do you not lock your doors? No, I have nothing to hide. <laughs> you think that ghosts are real, but you don't lock your doors? No, ghosts couldn't open my doors. They could walk through my walls, Anton. Okay, you need to be more concerned with murderers. So, remember those missing hikers? Yeah. What if I showed you leaked photos from one of their cameras, photos that show them at Hackett's Quarry, supposedly where the camera was found? Oh. I would think that maybe they went there and they dropped their the camera. camera okay, again. Anton, let me ask you real Emma? quick. What makes you drop the camera? Uh, yeah. Tripping she got over the camera a root. The... Um, she just being jostled. Mm. Uh, or was and it Jacob? Uneven, I think it was Emma, actually. Uh, row of cobblestones. Right. What about being murdered? The, if you dropped your phone, you tower. wouldn't go missing. Where are they now? Wasn't it? I don't know. People get lost in the yeah. woods all the time. There's I mean, like Jacob hundreds of he... people a year. They could be anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> no. Mm -mm. I'm about to lay a little something else on you. My sources also tell me that their backpacks were found at the summer camp. Oh, yeah. See? Really? Then, okay, well, then shouldn't this be public knowledge? Why aren't the Hackett's Emma prime suspects? That. Exactly my point. Maybe they would be if anyone knew where they were. That, Is it uh, all just a they, big cover-up operation? Yeah, that's where it falls apart a bit, in my opinion. So, we've got to talk a little more about the Hackett those back back families. Max right, so these guys are like the heritage landowners, right? Mm-hmm. Yep. Their great, great, great grandparents were trappers who claimed the land way back when. They just claimed it? Yes, they did. They put their flag on it just like the man on the moon. The Hackett family flag, right. Well, apparently when they claimed it, they found quartzite. Quartzite? Okay, I was hoping you would ask. Fun fact, every building in the whole of New York is made of quartzite. That's not fun or a fact. Most of them are. But I digest. Digress? It was a pun. They <laughs> dug the quarry and hit great heights of success before Septimus Hackett, classic bad guy name, the seventh son of the trappers, the number seven, has great supernatural powers, uh -huh. closed the mine down. Okay, so then they only had the land to live off. Yes, you say only, but this land actually spans acres. That's a lot of forest, a lot of unexplored darkness. Ooh, okay, a great place to hide, to have all these dark secrets for this strange, reclusive family. Mm -hmm. And this is where we start to get a little more into paranormal territory. Okay, here acres we go. Acres and acres of haunted woods. If you say so. Oh, oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, 
Uh oh. Welcome to Bizarre Yet Bonafide. Okay, we. Oh my god, are we playing as a crow? Yeah. What? We. I think that's the end? I mean. That's well. That was really nice. Alright, you can check on the pass, huh? Uh, okay, we saw that. Sure, we saw. Oh, the bear! And then the bear is used. E oh my god, that's so scary. That's so scary. What the heck? <laughs> to use the pull string. I think, like, if we went for Abigail, she would give us the silver bullet and then we would kill him anyways. Could you save Caleb? Was this savable, right? That's I don't a question. Know. That's a good question. Or they would try to climb down the ladder and now find the ladder was broken and they would like suffer an accident. I'm hmm. We'll have to investigate that. Abby offered Laura her bracelet to fashion I already saw that. There are some most of it. Ryan picked up the vial chopped by the hunter. Laura declined and Ryan offered but that didn't influence I guess because we shot the werewolf. So I guess if we didn't shoot him, he would attack Travis? I don't know. I'm glad we saved him. Oh, that Dylan, Dylan. He's alive. Oh, yeah. That's a really malformed body. God damn. Look at his neck. <laughs> Laura killed Silas ending his line of infection and curing every living person who was bitten at the Hackett Square. That was the right decision. That was the right decision because there are people involved that like if it was only the Hackett's family who like you know it wasn't even their fault it was Kaylee's fault. But I guess they covered it. But like there were like kids involved on this and they were suffering so. Sorry Salas boy. Did. Got saved and that's it. Well, I hope everybody liked it because we had a blast. Yeah, I really like that game. Yeah, it's really nice. I love those games like that you have like you could just go around and make choices. Those are really nice. Because it's like watching a movie, but mm -hmm. you get to be more involved. Yeah, and I guess you have you you. And like, everyone plays this game different, of course. Like, so everyone made like different choices. So it'd be nice also to see like other people playing it to see like what choices they made and why they made those choices. I think it's like also like important like to tell why you made the choices. You know, like your line of thinking. I think that's pretty interesting. Because mm -hmm. we made our choices kind of like together most of the time. Right? So uh -huh. we were like thinking together what to do and why. So I think that's like really nice. Like this game is awesome. We're gonna find another game to play like this. We'll probably buy the the old Walking Dead game with like six seasons. Oh yes, I wanna play that so bad. <laughs> <laughs> and there's like six seasons to that one, so it's gonna be like a lot of videos to make, which is gonna be pretty nice. And I hope to see you guys when we do that. If you guys have any games to request, just make sure you request in the comments and we'll try to to make videos for you guys. So thanks so much for watching. I hope you guys had a blast. We have plans for the channel and one of the plans I think is uh, we're gonna make like a little review, like a little like honest review on the games we play. We don't know yet if we have time for that. But if we decide to, it'll be like short, like 15 maximum minute videos with like a review of the games we played. Uh, so far, by the time we are finishing this game, we have played Resident Evil 4 Remake, um, The Last of Us Remake for PC, and The Quarry. So there's a lot more to come. We have a lot of games that uh, we would like to play uh, and post on YouTube. A lot of games that we haven't played yet, too. Um, all the games we've played so far on the channel, we haven't played yet. We just wanted to play them for a long time. 
but we now have the chance and incentive so we are posting that one so there's a lot like we have plans for the channel we just don't have the time yet but if we get you know if we have more viewers if we get some views we will, we will sure like find more time to to do more things for the channel so thanks so much for watching again and i'll see you guys on the next video yeah thank you <laughs> bye bye bye